my bow is a crayon. Ooh. Hi everyone. Today on So Craftastic, I'm going to show you how to make shaped glitter crayons. Ooh. This is the mold that I'm going to be using. Bows. I got this from eBay, but you can use any silicone mold that you can find and a great tip is to go to the craft store and take your 40% off coupon so you can get it for mega cheap. I prefer to make these using the oven but you can also use a microwave so I'm going to show you both ways in this video. If you want me to keep making more crayon tutorials then please give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Now uh, let's throw some glitter and make it rain. On to the tutorial. Grab a fun shaped silicone mold and some crayons. Now you're going to peel off all of the wrappers. Break up those crayons into really tiny pieces and scatter them into the molds. Once the oven has preheated at about 230 degrees, it is time to melt the wax. Place your silicone mold on a baking sheet and then slide it into the oven. Bake until melted. It should take anywhere from about 10 to 15 minutes. For me, it took 12. Once the crayons are completely melted, you can carefully remove them from the oven. You're going to want to use a couple oven mitts for this. Now it's time for the glitter. If you don't like glitter, you can just skip this step and you'll get some amazing crayons, but I love glitter, so just pour glitter in, sprinkle it in, whatever you want to do, and you can even kind of fold it or mix it in with a toothpick. Now you just have to wait until they are completely cool and then you can carefully pop them out. microwave crayons, put your mold into the microwave. Again, times are going to vary depending on your specific microwave, but what I like to do is put it in for three minutes at first, then I open it up and I stir them around a little bit because a tiny bit has melted at this point. Now I put them in for two more minutes, again open it up and stir, and I'm putting them in now for two more minutes and now they're done. So for me, a total of seven minutes in the microwave. And just so I don't spill my wax, I'm going to add the glitter while it's in the microwave. So I'm just adding it the same way I did with the oven crayons. And I'm going to let it cool a little bit and then remove the entire um, tray from the microwave. If you can. If not, just let it cool in there and then take out the mold when it's ready. Once they're cool, pop them out and you are ready to color. These crayons would make perfect party favors and little kids will love them. So if you're going to babysit someone or spend time with your little cousins or brothers and sisters, then make these crayons with them and grab a giant poster board and let them go to town. It's not going to make a mess when you color. The glitter is going to stay on the paper for the most part. making your own shaped crayons and please use hashtag SoCraftastic on Instagram to show me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you end up making your own glitter crayons or if you don't like glitter, you don't have to add glitter, but if you end up making your own shaped crayons then please show me by using hashtag SoCraftastic on Instagram. I need to keep my hands still. Okay. This week on Crafty Friday, I'm going to be doing a clay charm, so stay tuned for that, and I hope to see you then. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye. I almost snapped. Beautiful. Glitter. That was me throwing glitter. Fake glitter. So I'm going to show you both ways, and that was for both ways. So I'm going to show... Once the oven has preheated at a... Stop. Oh!
Woohoos! Yeah. Also, sub sub <gasps> talking failure number 76. Ew. <laughs> that was really strange.